Okay, I don't know what's going on. Okay, wait. You can hear me now. I see your thumbs. I see it, I see it, I see it, I see it. Okay. Who has... I'm just going to talk at you guys because my whole purpose in this stream is to make my streams better and I want to start playing some games. I have the PS4 Pro, got it set up. Um, I got the Elgato capture card. I'll show you down here next to my noodles, which I haven't eaten yet, but it's right there. Um, I have it all set up. But for some reason, OBS was being so glitchy today, and I pretty much got everything to the point where all I needed to do was set up a mic, and then I got this, and I'm going to show you guys because it's still doing it. Um, can you see that? Oh, where's this way? So it says OBS is already running unless... Basically, it's saying OBS is already running even after I restart my computer. And, um, yeah, it... It's not running, and so I just have to force open it, and, um, yeah, it's working like a piece of crap. So I've been trying all day, I restarted the computer, I basically, like, cleared everything, reset everything up, um, yeah, a lurker, O2, I, I agree, I did some research, I talked to a couple friends, and they just said sometimes OBS just sucks, and that's pretty much, like, the gist of it you couldn't really I couldn't really do anything about it and I looked up um, some other software to see if maybe um, there was better software that I could get but that doesn't seem to be the case there's really nothing else thanks nerd and crafts but what I'm trying to do right now is I'm trying to turn down the sound on the PlayStation because is that better? Um, so a lot of people have more problems with OBS Studio than basic OBS XSplit sucks. That's what I've heard XSplit sucks. But um, yeah, I have OBS Studio, so I guess I'm screwed. I don't know. I don't really know what to do. Um, I'm trying to figure it out. I'm trying to figure out the best way to play games where it's not super glitchy. So I was using uh, the PlayStation... Oh, there's a Streamlabs version of OBS. Um, I was using the PlayStation Remote Play, and it seemed to be working great. I didn't have to have all this crap hooked up. I just had the PlayStation on, and then I was playing, and then it was working great, and I think I spoke too soon. I said, this was really surprisingly super easy. And after I said that, it started getting really glitchy and laggy. Um, switching to OB, uh, basic OBS. <sighs> that means I have to reinstall everything, though, and I don't want to do that. But this Streamlabs, Be Wicked, Streamlabs version of OBS, that sounds interesting. I'll have to check that out. And on my app, it doesn't... Oh, there it shows me making a really stupid face. Um, so, yeah, I will try to figure out what... Streamlabs OBS is way better than regular OBS. I'll try that. Streamlabs is pretty awesome with all of like the notifications and everything that you can do with it. It's pretty cool. Um, so I will try that. I'm going to eat some of my noodles because they're probably cold. Yeah, the second camera um, was, if anyone knows what they're doing, to try to help me figure it out because I have no idea what's going Oh, I'm making a mess already. Um... I have no idea what I'm doing, but, so, I'm going to show you, my food is on the table too, but I have the, um, Battlefront Edition, got Friday the 13th, the game too, you can see it, uh, so I have that, I have the Elgato, and then I have it all hooked up to, um, whoa, I'm just going to see my cool Halloween stuff over there for now, um, I have it hook hooked all up, one to... <laughs> You guys want to see me eat noodles? Yes, please uh, be wicked. Please post that link. I have a Streamlabs account, so if it's with that, then easy peasy. I know what to do there. Um, but if there's anything additional I need to do, let me know. Thank you. And there's like my... Can you see my Freddy back there? Freddy poster. Um, yeah, so, uh, 
I do have an MSI lap uh, MSI laptop. I love it. It's awesome. It's got the sweet like light up keyboard. <laughs> Someone said forget the game and just eat noodles. I'm just gonna eat the noodles because I'm starving. Um. So, the comment. It is an MSI laptop. MSI laptop. Yes, it is. People are asking me to play some games. I am trying for the life of me. I promise you. I got this thing maybe like three or four days ago, and I set it up. Um, set it up with remote play. It was working awesome. And then I actually went to try to stream it, and it was super glitchy. So I realized I have to get a capture card. How to do all that mess? And OBS has just been my worst nightmare today. So. Um, I thought I was going to stream some games tonight, but it's not going to happen because it's not working. Um, like I have it, let me turn it back on. Um, there it is. But see, it's so, I'm going to, I'm going to see if I can see it. It's so tiny right now. Play noodles and eat games. I'm gonna try to. Okay, so I can't. I'm gonna make it bigger because I can't see it. You guys probably can't see it either. We're gonna move it up. Sorry, I just gotta figure out. You guys are gonna have to um, watch me struggle a little bit. Okay, so this one's on the bottom, so it needs to be above the. There we go. Okay, so I'm going to try to make this smaller, make this one a little bit bigger, and I'm going to turn number two off because we don't need it. Okay, so I'm going to see if it works. <laughs> oh no, my hand is not severed. I spy an Ewok. Where's the Ewoks? Oh yeah, they're right behind me. Okay, so we're gonna do like an offline play because I am not awesome at the game yet and it's embarrassing. And we're gonna do this one. Um, I like Camp Crystal Lake. Hey Pablo! Hi! Tell Pops I say hi. Miss you guys. Okay... Um, I don't know what I'm doing. Hi, Carlos. Um, how do we freaking do it? Go. Accept. See, and then this was happening too, where, um, the controller will hit the button and the controller doesn't respond. So it's been a great day of um, I'm so grateful, I know. Um, oh, sorry, let me move that. No, I'm gonna move that down there. Okay, so earlier, um, is that better? Okay, okay. Oh, no. So it took me forever to, uh, where am I going? To, um, figure out how to, like, swing and move around and do stuff, and then I was in the water and then realized you can't. He goes really slow. Like, unbelievably slow. So I spent a lot of time just walking around. And there's no way to go faster. Unless someone knows something that I don't know. Sense is available. Guys, I can't be big eating the noodles and play the game at the same time. Oh wait, you can run with him. It's L3. There's no L3 my map. There's only L2, R3, R1, R2, 
L1, L2, there's no three, people. The thumb, yeah, I'm, see, that's as fast as he goes. That's swing. This is, I don't know. That is choke. L3 is the button on, oh! Go. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Okay. <laughs> this, but he's still not going very fast. He's like a turtle run. Come on, Jason, you have people to kill. There we go. Yeah, I'm learning. You guys are teaching me. I don't know where I'm going. It's gonna get cozy. Oh, I can't go there. We're gonna go back. Okay, so there was the map, and then I can do... Is that not enabled yet? So I think at a certain point, I can, um... Oh, excuse me. I can... Shift is available. I need to wait for, um, morph? Is it morph? Or something else where then I can, like, teleport. There's people over there. My chat. Game sound is a little low. Sorry, I gotta turn it up. Me. Is that better? Oh no, they're trying to escape. I don't think... Where are you? Noodle burps are so attractive. I'm, I'm just bringing my A game, guys. Uh, you back in relaxing while kids... Yeah. Can we talk about this whole eating the laundry pods? How stupid are you people? Why are you doing that? Okay. Sorry, it was low. Okay. Oh, morph. Yes, is morph. My morph isn't a bit available, I don't think. So this was me earlier. Yeah, the map is on the touchpad, but at a certain point when you can, when you can morph, um, you can like pick somewhere on the map and then it takes you, but right now, <laughs> yeah, I'm, see the good thing about being Jason though is they can't really kill me. So, come on, dude, let's move it. I like swimming though, it's pretty cool. Folks. Are you saying the solution to over- oh sh I'm not paying attention. The solution to overpopulation is eating laundry pods? Did they really lock them up? That's sad. Stop. Oh wait, I think I have more. Hold on. Yeah, I do. Okay. I don't really know. I think this is where I started. For a big guy, he's pretty slow. He is really slow. Even his run is not very good. Copy on the road therapy. Ah. They're inside. Guys, they're inside. And then I forget that you guys are here, so I get really quiet. Where is everybody? I'm gonna go swim in the water, because it's fun. Where's the water? It's out here somewhere. Swim, Jason, swim. Can we swim faster too? Yeah, we can. Oh, people. Excuse me, I got noodle burps.
that's the way to get around. Oh my god, he walks so slow. Can break the door. Why is it open? Come on. That's all you got. Break it. Oh. Wait, what does it say? Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Oh. And nobody's in this tiny box. Okay, I'm gonna check my, my chat's on my phone and it keeps, um, I'm gonna eat some noodles while I change this on my phone because I can't see the chat, it keeps timing out. Um, I don't have any mods on here, I do need to do that. I haven't, uh, any pointers, let me know, um. I haven't been streaming for very long, so I'm still, this is kind of new to me. I'm trying to figure it out. Uh, where's my settings? Time out. Never. And we're back. Okay. Hi, everybody. And uh, I think the only other game that I have right now, since it's the eye icon, is, um... Ah! Oh, oh no, somebody's here. And once I get better at this, I'll play with you guys online, but I suck right now, so nobody wants me on their team. is everybody run thanks for the run tip guys because I figured I was like if he walks that slow nothing's ever gonna happen in this game inside I'm gonna break another door um battlefront hi battlefront um maybe we'll play Maybe we'll do that, because I feel like that's... We'll give it a little bit more and see if we can kill somebody, and then we'll jump on that. I'm going to walk slow so I can eat noodles. What a terrible camera angle. Okay, any tips on how do I freaking find people? I know there's like the little circle things, but where are the people? Yeah, you know what? People have been pretty nice in my chats, and I like it that way. Use sense to find people. Which one sense? The eyeball. Are those the little red things? Yes. Run towards the blinking circles. Yeah, I know. I see that, and that's what I've been doing. The red things are fear. If people have the fear. Oh, I'm out. I need more. Oh, I see a person, I think. No. Oh wait, I can do it now. Oh, I see you. I see you. Run. Come on. Guys. Finally. 
No, no. That's it? That's as fast as he goes? Oh, give me a break. Um, no, I'm not online with other players right now. I'm just doing, uh... What the hell, man? Freaking turtle here. Oh, I don't really watch a lot of streamers. I watch my friends. That's pretty much it. I also, um, am making an attempt to have more, make more time for streaming. Uh, because my schedule is super busy. Oh, I see them. I see you. I see you. Run! Faster! So slow. So slow. Not even so slow. Come on. Oh, oh. Let me get you. The anticipation, guys. Go! Go! No, 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 no. Oh, looks like you're dead, sucker! Oh no. There's people inside. I like it when the mom talks. It's super creepy. Uh, so I was playing a little earlier, attempting to kind of practice so I wasn't terrible, and I got- How did you get out of here so fast? I got fireworks to the face. I, well, I killed one person in like 20 minutes. Something, yeah? I can't read your comments and play and eat noodles at the same time. Oh, you can use the warp speed. How do I use that? I really need to move this. I, I'm so bad. Warp speed. How to do it? Chat. 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 Okay. Um, hockey mask is hold R1 and D pad, I think. Can you guys just put a bunch of, like, things that make it easier for me in this game in the comments? Oh, also earlier, they probably can't hear because it's not loud enough, but the sound was turned up and the dogs, when they hear a fire alarm, or a fire alarm, a fire engine, they start barking and they were barking for so long. I was like, it's just the game! I need to find the f okay. Someone said square. It's on the left side icon. Guys, I'm slow. I don't know what you're talking about. Go, run faster. Go. No. Okay, let's do this. Um. Look at how cool he looks. Look at that. Can I choke. You look pretty cool, dude. Um. R1 and then square. Now that is cool! Okay, now I know. Sony, hi! Hi, I miss you! Are you watching me struggle? Guys, everyone say um, hi to Sony in the chat. My buddy's here, Sony Erlen. I'm sure you guys know of her. She's awesome. And she's laughing at me struggle. It's fine. That's what I'm here for. Oh no, is my time up? <laughs> I killed one out of eight. <gasps> sad. So sad. Okay, we're gonna have some noodles. That's my good boy. And um Mommy has a reward. Turn that down and we're gonna talk about how terrible that was. But it's okay. Yay, Sony's here. So many noodles. Also, my noodles are cold.
Well, I got a hundred, whatever that is, because it killed one person. Yeah, I feel like 20 minutes of pure adorableness. I mean, thank you, but I we're gonna, we're gonna play offline. See, oh, I keep trying to use my keyboard too to try again. We'll do somewhere else. We'll do whatever this is. And yes, and yes. <laughs> yeah, I know. Guys, don't judge me. I'm not an awesome. I'm, I'm getting noodles everywhere. Um, I also have my rad headset, but I can't get it to work either, so I think I need something else. So if anyone has any tips on how to get that to work, I'd appreciate it, because I have no idea. I agree. A kill is a kill. Don't judge me. be wicked you should give it a shot but it, be here, Jason. I have Stop some um, Logitech G pretty rad headphones but for some reason um, I don't think I have the right connection to plug it into the PlayStation so I just I gave up I was like I don't have I can't sit here all day for one thing um, conventions I have some conventions to announce very soon but I haven't gotten all of the final details so Stay tuned, I'll have all that information um, on my website. Did you try plugging it in? I did try plugging it in. Um, I think my struggle with this whole setup business is I can stream from the PS4 directly to Twitch and um, it would be easy peasy. I just log on and do it, but I am trying to do it through OBS so that I can have all of my fancy Thing up in the corner and the alerts and donations and all that stuff so um, <laughs> yes cons were going yes hush hush for now um, but all the alerts and everything I wouldn't be able to get so I tried to do it the right way and clearly it's not working out for me um, break every mold I actually have a film coming out hopefully this year was supposed to come out last year. It is another horror film, which will be really fun. Um, and more news on that will be coming as I get it. So, update soon. Some headsets won't connect to the PS4. I'm unsure the headset is compatible. Hopefully the headset is USB. Yeah, it is USB and I have it plugged into it, but for some reason when I'm um, going through the Elgato to go to stream on OBS, it doesn't play in my headphones. So I don't know what the issue is. I really just need to find someone that knows what they're freaking doing and have them come help me. Baby steps. Yes, I agree. I also feel like um, technology is my very worst enemy. Oh, shift is available. Okay, so this is the eyeball thing. I want to see where the people are. in the house. Go. Go. Weird question. Oh, are you asking um, H. Stern like uh, downsizing? Would I do downsizing? Um, I don't know. If it was reversible, yes, because I think it would be really cool. Oh, I see a person. Um, to get a different perspective on things. Did they go? Is he outside? Um, but yeah, not forever. I don't want to be tiny and get smashed like an ant. Oh, excuse me. Oh god, it was complicated. A long time to tweak. Yes, I. It's just really frustrating. And I feel like a lot of the videos that I was finding online were similar situations to what I was doing, but not quite. I'm gonna break this door. Uh, not quite exactly what I, my system that I have, so I struggled. 
Open the door, Jason. Open it. Break it down. Like you mean it. <laughs> Honey, I shrunk the vamp. Yeah, because that is not subtle at all. You took fucking a year to- I mean... No bad words, sorry. And when I was playing earlier, I got scared of my shadow. I was like, oh god, that's it! No, that's just my shadow. What stock? Run, Jason. Oh, where are you? Where's the car? And I always hear the car, and I never see the car. I have to work on my game concentration phase because it's very intense. Stop, because you know, okay. This is how I'm going to have to play the games. I'm just going to ask you guys questions the entire time. Oh, somebody's trying to call. Oh. I think I'm supposed to, I'm supposed to break this, aren't I? No? No. Yeah, but that was a movie. I'm allowed to say it in movies. I can just, can I beat that? Can I kill that thing? Or break it? Or... He's not doing a very good job. Break it. Yeah. I think it's broken. Oh, oh me. Okay. I'm going to try to kill one person and <laughs> that's my goal. Just one. If this Slowpoke would keep it moving. I mean, I'm not really trying to just keep it PG. It just. There's better words I could use. Like. Oh, farts. I feel like that's better. It's funnier. No, no. Where's my little eyeball? I'm gonna see where you people are. No, no. Yeah, I don't know what my abilities are. Oh, I see people, I see them. Go, run. Do you see how fast they are? Do you see how fast they are and how freaking slow I am? Okay, how do I go fast? Tell me again. This is actually like a real horror movie though, where the, the guy, no, 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 no. Can I not go through the window? Give me a break. And then they disappear. Oh, I hear you. Oh, 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 too fast! Too- Really? I just warped right past, right through her. Ah! And Jason is sad again. Can we warp back to where we came from? No, we're out of that right now. I see you suckas. No, that's just a tree. Hit the square button again while warping. Well, yeah, now you tell me. Really? And I can't- can I jump over something? This is the worst stream ever. I really was just coming online to try to figure stuff out and then you guys convinced me to play. I should probably know how to play before I stream, but whatever. I'm gonna get you, and I'm not gonna do anything crazy. I'm just gonna try to run up to you like a 
normal killer and kill you. Really? No, no. <laughs> yeah, die, 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 die. Got one. Make them suffer like we. Jason, jump. He's a big man. Uh, this is basically a test stream, yes. I got one. Oh, there's so many more right here. But they're faster than me because I'm the slowest <gasps> person. Wasn't there one right there? Oh, that's a sign. Oh, I see you. Guys, I might get two. Did he go in the house? He went in the house, didn't he? Where are you? He's not in here. See, and then that happens all the time too, where I see them and it looks like they went in the house and then they're just gone. You know what I call that? Cheating. Oh! Can I get in trouble? I didn't know. Hold on, let me fix it. So I should be in gaming? No. There it is. Okay, I changed it. We should be good now. I will, technically I was in IRL because I was eating noodles and I was just talking to you guys, but then, um, now we are, have moved along. I don't know if you necessarily can get in, well, you probably can. The, the um, rules are very strange. Oh, oh. Where'd he go? Run faster. I'm gonna try the... Okay, we're gonna try the warp thing. Hold on. See, I did it again. What? Get what? I don't like. I don't like it. Now I'm in a rock. Uh, I tried. Oh, they're camping. I want to go for- okay, we're gonna try it, we're gonna try it, we're gonna try it, we're gonna try it! See, what? No, 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 no! Come on! Come out, little girl! Damn it! See, she's in the house. She couldn't have come out that fast, because I would see her. A bunch of nonsense. Tree was, the, oh, I see you. You're in here. Please. No. <laughs> Guys, <laughs> it's so sad. Um, wait, what do you do to prevent them? I think you can break the windows too. <sighs> that window dive. You, my friend, are not very good at this. My noodles are cold. I'm sad because I can't kill any of the counselors. You can, I'm just gonna read and look. I'm pretty sure it's my favorite stream ever. You know what, Sony? Really, if this is just about you. I'm here to please you. And you could just, breaking windows hurts them, but yeah, they could just run away and I can't dive through a window. 
Unless I can, and I don't know. You guys need to tell me. Go back to the town. Go back. Go back. We're gonna use this. I see you people. Run, you little son of a... Go! I'm gonna get her. What does R1 in circle do? I don't know. Oh, that's the map. I don't want that. Come on! I think I'm out of the speed thing, the warp. <sighs> so sad. I've only killed one, right? Can we just get the move on here, dude? Oh my god, all day. Oh, there she is. Get her. Get her. She doesn't even see me coming. No! Oh, no! Yeah. Rage is on. What is rage? Get her. You are literally the slowest killer on the planet. Oh, tree. <laughs> Don't stop chasing. They deserve to die. Make them suffer like we did. One person per round. Hey, um, fat ass Buddha, that's two per two persons. That's two people. Murder or noodles? It's really all you need. Oh, how do you grab people? It's this one. Two people. That's right. Here to entertain. Oh, maybe I will. I'll be a counselor, but I don't think I can be a counselor in the offline mode. I have to actually play with people, and I feel like that's just not fair to them because I suck. Two people per round now. Yeah. Moving up in the world. Um, I feel like next time I'm just going to Battlefront and be Kylo Ren and just beat the crap out of things. Is there anybody? I like swimming. Yeah, offline is only Jason. Okay, let's see where the people are. Where are the people? We're gonna... Oh, that's the warp. I don't want to do that. We're done. We're done. And we're in a rock. Ooh, that's cool. world's fastest swimmer. I know, he can swim really fast, but he can't, he, like, he couldn't swing until he was standing with his head outside of the water. So, I don't know if you can grab underwater, I'm not sure. <sighs> My noodles are really spicy. Do I have any? I don't think I have... I'm just like wandering around in the forest at night by myself. You can grab underwater? How two minutes remain. Well, I killed two people, so um, it's getting really intense. Can you feel it? I can feel it. Run, Jason, run. You have two minutes to do something. It's a drown move. Yeah, I need to get, I need to look up like all the moves. Um, eh, nothing's gonna happen in this next two minutes. 
So just don't get your hopes up. Oh, I don't think you can go that way. That's like the end of the map. I'm just gonna read you. I'm just gonna, don't forget R1 and triangle. Oh, and then I can be stealthy and they won't see me coming. I got two already, it's true. I'm proud of myself. Two out of eight, that's still failing, but it's fine in my book. And they won't hear me. Good to know. Jason, you... These counselors are super... Oh, I see somebody. Go, run, 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 run. There it is. They're gonna be over there. How much time do I have left? You're gonna die. Oh, son of a... And it's over. Well, that was fun. Two out of eight. Mommy is proud of Change the audio settings for your headset. <laughs> World's coldest noodles. Um, okay, well, I'm gonna spare you guys. Because as exciting as that um, is for me, I'm sure it's not as exciting for you. Um, thanks, I'm glad you're proud of me. I tried real hard. Um, Jason goes jogging. All right, so I will spare you another round of that. What time is it? Let's see. How long have we been on? Oh, that would have been easier to see it that way. Um, I'm gonna turn it down. We'll do a little Q&A, some questions for a bit, and then we can play another round and see if I can get three. Oh Lord, too big. Um. Stop it. Stop it. Come on. Uh, if we could get three out of eight next round. Try how to play. Maybe that will help you get the hang of. You know what was weird is there was a, a setting on here and when I, it wasn't working earlier. Oh. Now it's working. So lame. It wasn't working earlier. There was nothing. It wasn't even like letting me select it. Um, but I think a lot of my issues that I was running into earlier were because of the OBS system. Because if I was in the Elgato and I was playing it through Elgato, it was fine. There was no lag. On the second I brought it over to OBS, it just all took a big old crap. Mm. I know, I feel like being bad at it is more entertaining than being really good at it. Because you can watch all over Twitch people be really awesome at games, but to watch someone continuously suck, that's a little bit of a talent in itself. Wait. Break every mold. Palm Springs Comic Con. Oh! No worries, man. No harm, no foul. It's all good. We had a good conversation about it, so no worries at all. Yeah, I agree. We all have to start somewhere. Not everybody's a professional, and I take pride in the fact that I'm not awesome. So, I'm just going to sit here and eat my noodles, because clearly gaming is not my strong suit. But what I want to get is um, some old school like Atari games. If any of you guys know, is it possible to hack this thing so I can get some old school games? Um,
and see if that would be more fun. Because that's like brainless. I mean, not that it's super easy, but I feel like it's easier than this. Um, sorry, I'm trying to catch up on any comments. Oh, other games. So I just got the PS4 this past week, so I have not, haven't even had it for a full week. And the only other game right now that I have is uh, Battlefront, which I played a little bit just like in the practice mode. Um, and I killed, how many did I ha how many people? There was 20, and I think I killed like one round, I killed 18, so that's pretty damn good. So it's better than two, or one. Um, oh, I'm so zoned out on the questions. Uh, yeah, so Q&A, ask me. Thanks. I will answer while I eat my noodles. They're so cold and kind of sad, but it's okay. Yeah, if you guys um have um good recommendations about like other games to play, things that are fun. I like things that are not so intense because I want to interact with you guys. I don't want it just to be me zoned out on the game the whole time because that's no fun. At least I don't feel like that's very fun. Change game to IRL if you haven't. Oh, yeah, I should, huh? Mm hmm. We're gonna pause this to IRL because we're not doing anything with the game right now. Oh, there we go. Update. Um, you guys have so many comments. Sad noodles. They are sad. They're still tasty, though. But on a scale of uh, one to hot, they are a one. Um... Yeah, everyone's saying Overwatch. Um, the Tide Pods. We're gonna have one more go at this because it's ridiculous. Why are you eating soap? Children, teenagers, youngsters, YouTubers, why are you eating soap? It's not a good thing. It's bad for you. It'll make you sick. I think kids have died, pretty sure. Don't quote me, but I think they have. Um, yeah, so just don't do that. I thought it was a joke. I thought they just put them in their mouth and they would hold them in their mouth. I didn't realize they're actually swallowing them. Kind of noodles. They are spicy, chili, picante. I don't know, they're hot. It's good. Um, creative streams. I don't know. I haven't really thought about it. Um... I haven't done a whole lot of costume creation lately. I've been kind of doing a bunch of other projects, um, working on my puppet show, um, movies, shows, just a lot of other things that have been taking priority. Um, things that kind of have been priority the entire time. Cosplay was kind of one of those sidetracks that just popped up and um, gave me great opportunities, so I, I took them, and, um, I was able to do some really awesome things, and I still can do, and I'm continuing to do really awesome things in that world, but it's not my focus, um, I've been focusing a lot more on my personal projects, my shows, um, things like this, like trying to get streaming up so I can interact more with you guys, um, all that kind of stuff, so, creative streams, I don't know, I thought about doing maybe, like, some fun cooking ones, or, like, cool how-tos, uh, I don't know, Give me your ideas. Tell me what you guys want to see. Yeah, you know what? I have a copy of The Witcher. Let me see if it's over here. Somewhere. Is it here? I don't know. I'll have to look for it. But I want to play that because that's going to be super fun. <laughs> Yeah, I agree. I, f I feel like hoverboards would be a great addition to 2018. I feel like we're at that point where we should have them. And uh, watching people eat soap is blowing my mind. And the thing is, 
it's weird how social media works and it's weird how things blow up that you would think are common sense. Like, don't eat soap. Why would you do that? That's not a smart thing to do. But then someone does it on social media and then it becomes a, a viral trend or whatever they're calling it. Uh, it's, it's really sad. Just eat noodles forever. I like that idea. I could do that. Um, sorry, I get distracted. Um, Monster Hunter World. Oh, okay. I do remember trying soap because of A Christmas Story too. because eating soap. But I never... Who, who here ever had their mouth washed out with soap? Show of hands. Please tell me. Assassin's Creed game. Noted. All of these things, I'm taking note. Favorite game genres? Um, probably horror, as you can tell by this room around me. I don't know if you can see. Ooh. Like all of my horror stuff in the wall. There's the face hugger. Where is it? Oh, look at look at who's up on the wall. Look at that. Jason. And there's a face hugger on my lamp. I have a super creepy uh, Minnie Mouse puppet that we got at a con in Mexico. And um, a really creepy... Oh my god, I have something else to show you guys. Hold on. If I can get it without... I'm going to put this down. Oh. If you've seen the movie Critters... I have my very own critter. How cool is he? And his little hands. Wait, I can never figure this out because it's opposite. His little hands and his little claws, his little toes. He's actually a puppet, but he's on a little stand right now, so. So creepy and cute. Okay, I'm gonna put it back. <sighs> so yes, genre, favorite genre is horror. I miss a lot of goddamn critters. Evil Within 2, Outlast Trinity. I saw all of those in um, the store, and I think I have, one of my patrons gave me a code, so I have uh, a year subscription, so I'll see if I have any of, like, access to any of those games, because that would be fun. Critters game would be so rad. Multitasking. What else do I have in this room? Um, oh, my Freddy glove up there, but you guys have seen my Freddy glove in my... Wait, there it is. There's Mr. T with kittens. And Elvira's down there. Oh, and then I think you guys saw this in one of my other streams. Little Chucky. I need to move this camera out of the way. He's so creepy and cute. Let me switch these. Come on. Come on. There it is. He's got a little. Okay. And then this guy that. This is from one of my patrons. So cute. Hopefully this is not your bedroom. Um, no, but my bedroom is just as creepy. Mr. T with kittens. Everybody needs a poster of Mr. T with kittens. Oh, that's pretty rad. Signed script from Robert England. That's pretty cool. Oh, the lag on this is terrible right now. Oh, guys, Sony just mentioned me and her story. I'm gonna see what she said. Thanks, Oni. <laughs> if you're still here. If not, thanks anyway. Um, so what do you guys want to do? 
eat some more noodles. I'll finish my noodles and then maybe we'll play another round. You hate dolls? Why do you hate dolls? Why would you hate this? Look how cute it is. It's gonna sit while I eat noodles. Booze stream. I have no booze. Cold noodle and murder. I mean. Murder and horror. Top interests of mine. Good night, Vampire Knight. Thanks for joining. Oh my god. Can we talk about it? I just watched it. last night for the second time it's so good the kids all the actors in it are so good they're perfect it's the humor is great and uh, it's creepy I really liked it thought they did an awesome job um, I remember the original and I'm still a huge fan of the original and sometimes when something new comes out I'm super skeptical because I just I don't know I just don't want them to ruin it, and they did such a great job with the film, so I was very impressed. Actually, um, I rented it, but I'm definitely going to buy it, because I need to see it again and again and again. I have seen the original TV version, and it's funny watching it now, because when I was younger, it terrified me. I mean, t I was... My fear of clowns came from that um, series, and so freaked out, and uh, so at one point... My mom, I don't know why she thought this was a great idea, but like I showed you the corner of this room where that light's hanging up there. Can you see it? See that light that's hanging up there, like from the ceiling? She had a, uh, it was a swing, and it had a clown on a swing, and so the clown's holding the, basically like the chains of the swing, and I swear to God, I would look up and that thing was moving and it terrified me and I remember one night just going up taking it down and throwing it in my closet and I actually don't remember we moved from that house I don't remember what happened to it or if I left it there I don't know but it scared the crap out of me like terrified I was so terrified of clowns and then my mom puts a freaking hanging clown on a swing in my room um so yeah thanks to the movie it it um gave me a fear of clowns, but I'm not afraid of them anymore, <laughs> question mark, no, I'm not afraid of them anymore, um, but Pennywise in the new film is pretty epic. Uh, the Exorcist is pretty intense, that one, another, that was another one that I saw when, uh, I think I've said this in a previous stream, but that was my first horror movie where I realized I was a fan of horror. I was at my friend's house and she, um, at the time, she, they lived up in the hills and at the time you didn't lock your doors, people didn't have screens on their windows, you just, just wasn't a worry. And so we were at her house, she puts on the movie, I'm sitting on the couch, literally like curled up into a ball, hiding. And uh, she falls asleep. I stayed up all night with my eyes like this. I was terrified. All the windows there were open. There was no screens on them. The door was open. I don't think I slept that night. I was so scared. But the next, once the sun came up, and I was like, I want to watch something scary again. So that's when I knew that I was super into horror. Life size Freddy. Oh, I have a life size kind of Freddy poster. He's right there. He's actually two big movie posters. And I, we had to cut it in half and then put him in two separate frames. One part of the Georgie scene that made me picky. Yeah, um, I kind of saw that too. If, but, but think about this though. So say that that happened to you and something bit your arm off. I think that you would be in shock and maybe like watching it, you would assume your reaction would be to scream immediately would think you would want to scream but I think in that sense where if that happened to you you would be in shock and you wouldn't say anything 
So I give them a pass on that because I, I did think that when I watched it again last night and I was like, you know what, if something got ripped off, like a little kid would probably scream, but if he was in shock, he maybe wouldn't scream. So that's my take on that. X-Wing, you can't watch horror. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. It's not scary. It's not real. Well, or is it? I don't know. Oh, my, my video on my thing's frozen. What happened? Oh, the thing. That's classic. So many things. I was thinking about this the other night. So after I watched it and then I had to go like get ready for bed and wash my face and all that stuff. And I'm walking down the hallway and there's something about after you watch a horror movie that you just have a feeling that something's just around you and you have to look over your shoulder and I didn't want to look in the mirror because I was afraid something was going to be behind me but I think that's one of the things that draws me to it so much is it gets your blood pumping you get a little scared uh you're kind of on your toes and I don't know there's something about that that just makes me want to watch it more and be scared more Resident Evil 7 I would like to play some Resident Evil I think that would be fun Okay, first horror movie in the comments. Tell me what your first horror movie was. Badass Buddha already told me Texas Chainsaw Massacre. That's funny. Used to sprint up the stairs after turning the lights off. It's scary. It's something, it's insidious. Good stuff. I have to say that I'm not afraid of the dark. I mean, really, I don't think there's, doesn't freak me out, but the dark after watching a scary movie or um the dark when we were filming ghosted holy crap um so if you're not familiar with my show ghosted it's available on the go 90 app you can also get it on go 90.com and it's called ghosted and essentially it's a ghost hunting travel show so we would go to different locations in the south we would meet the people we would eat the food um, and then at night we would go ghost hunting so there was plenty of crazy locations and lots of crazy things and lots of things that would happen that honestly I was very skeptical going into it but there's so many things that happened that I could not explain like I just I had I couldn't explain it there was things that we would watch a video we would listen to audio to watch playback and I just there was no explanation for what happened so at that point the first time it happens I'm like okay that's a coincidence second time it happens well that's kind of weird but it could be this or that. The third and fourth and fifth and sixth and seventh and so on, I'm like, okay, the, something's going on here. And um, what I discovered was that there's something, and you guys may have heard of this, you may have not, uh, something called an empath. And essentially what that is, is it's a person that can feel what others ha are feeling or have felt and you absorb that emotion or energy or whatever it is and it kind of goes through you and you feel what that person was feeling and I had a few instances where that happened where I would like out of nowhere start bawling be terrified feel like I needed to run out of the room and everyone around me would kind of look at me like what the hell is wrong like what is going on with her and I would just be bawling and freaked out and then I realized that what was happening is I was feeling the emotions of these spirits and most people probably are going to say that's bullshit whatever that's not real um which is fine because i don't expect anyone to believe me you become a believer when something happens to you so most people aren't going to believe unless they have you know some sort of personal experience and that was kind of the same thing for me this whole time i'm like please like something happened because i just feel like there's really not a whole lot going on and I don't know if I really believe this and the second something happens to you it's literally an oh shit moment you you kind of you freak out and once I realized what was happening and someone um, my friend Chad was one of the EPs on the show he basically sat with me and he was like this is what's going on this is what you're feeling this is why and once I realized what was going on I was like okay I get it I'm not scared anymore because I know but being in those rooms where they would say most of the time we did ghost hunting with the crew. So it's me, 
but then I have two camera guys. I have um, someone on the night vision camera. There's the audio guy. So that at all times there was like three or four people around me. So I'm ghost hunting and I'm I'm technically doing it on my own, but I have this crew of people with me. Um, there was one night where they basically said, here's the night vision camera, take it, and I'm holding it. And uh, he's like, all right, you're gonna go up into this old prison, we're gonna lock the door behind you, and you're gonna be by yourself. And I was like, yeah, no, that's not happening. <laughs> we're not doing that. And he's like, yeah, you are. And then I realized, I'm like, this is a show, we're filming a show, I have to. And so I did it, and I literally was, you can watch the footage and you can see my eyes are like glazed over because I was ready to cry the entire time. I was so terrified and I'm in this giant um, room in this old prison all by myself. It's dark. I can't see anything but what I can see through the camera. And I start freaking myself out. I start seeing things. And at one moment, I literally uh, l sat down in this building I put my like body like this and I pushed myself up against the wall so I could feel like something around me and I sat there trying not to cry for <laughs> probably 45 minutes which to me felt like I was in there for five minutes but they actually started walking up the stairs to come get me because they thought something was wrong because uh, I was gone for so long but it was a, a crazy experience on how being by yourself being in the dark having no control having no idea of what's around you like makes your whole body and everything in you change. I was terrified. Like with every piece of my being, I was terrified. And the rest of the night we filmed for probably four or five, maybe five to six more hours. So there was a lot more work to do after that. And I remember um, I had a friend come and do ghost hunting with me and I literally had my hand around his arm and I wouldn't let go. I was so scared. And so much crazy stuff happened. If you guys want to watch any of the episodes, you can go to go90.com or download the Go90 app. And you can watch, I believe there's eight episodes on there. And they're in little sections, but if you just start from the first one, you can watch the whole season. It's all up now online. So feel free to check it out. Let me know what you think. Um, if you like it. And if you do, if you want to see more. Um, yeah. That was a tangent, guys. Sorry about that. I'm gonna go read your comments while I was blabbing. You know what is a weird thing is I've been trying to find out from them um, about Ghosted because I know it's still only available in the United States. So I don't. I'm gonna find out and see if there's a way that people outside of the U.S. can watch it. Um, if that's a permanent thing or if that's only gonna be temporary and eventually it'll be released to everyone. So I'll let you guys know. Thanks, Nail Ma'am. I'm glad you liked it. It was very fun. I mean, I say fun, but there was so many nights where um, we'd get back to the hotel because we were driving, was a road trip through the South. So we flew to New Orleans, we started in New Orleans, um, and then we went to Alabama, Mississippi, uh, Georgia, South Carolina. So we drove through the entire South. And there was basically every night after filming, like after crazy things would happen, I didn't want to go to the bathroom by myself and it's a hotel room like it's probably as big as the room that I'm in right now it's tiny and there's a bathroom right there like you could see everything but I was so freaked out um, I'd have a hard time sleeping um, so that stuff is no joke I mean I watch ghost hunting shows on TV all the time and I'm always thinking that it's crap and it's all made up but it's not <laughs> and it can be very scary so yeah have any of you guys ever done any ghost hunting at all let me know because that could be a fun stream I have um, a whole like ghost hunting kit it's a coffin case and it has all my ghost hunting gear in it maybe we'll do a stream where um, I bring out all that stuff and uh, show you guys about ghost hunting I actually haven't brought it out in uh, my house because I don't want to know if there's ghosts here um, but for you guys, I'll bring it out in this room. <laughs> Some scary life experiences can be fun. Did you eat crawfish in Louisiana? Um, I didn't actually have any uh, crawfish, but we went to, well, maybe. Um, we had some gumbo at Acme, Acme Oyster House. 
Charles Acme something. It's on um, Bourbon Street in New Orleans. And it was delicious, and it, it was seafood gumbo, so I'm sure it probably had crawfish in it, but not just straight crawfish. Um, what happened in San Antonio? Okay. Fat-ass Buddha, tell me what happened in San Antonio. And who is this? L-O-O-E-E-C-E. -E -E. I don't know how to say your name. Um, you should do a Ouija board stream. So, I have a lot of Ouija boards. Cameron loves them. We collect them. They're beautiful. They're red boards, and it's beautiful art to me. But I won't play with one. Um, growing up, my mom told me a story that terrified me. She had a crazy experience with a Ouija board and her, um, my grandma and grandpa were very Catholic. So when they found out that my mom and her sister had played with the Ouija board, they brought the priest, they blessed the house, like they had to get rid of it. They got in big trouble. And to me, a Ouija board is a gateway. And if you have that in your home, and you bring that out and you play with it, you're essentially opening up that door and you're allowing something in. It could be good, it could be bad, it could be whatever. Um, but you, by playing with it, have said, hello, hi, come in, and I'm not down with that. So uh, one of my friends had told me, he said, it doesn't have to be a Ouija board, it doesn't have to be a planchette, it could be this box right here and this bottle cap. And if you give this power, that could be your Ouija board. He always said it could be a Ouija banana, it doesn't matter. Um, but it's an item that you give power to. So although a Ouija board stream would probably be great for you guys, I'm terrified of that. So no on that one. But thanks for the suggestion. <laughs> As in low, low. S. Louise. Oh, I don't know what just happened. Oh, never mind. No boards. <laughs> yeah, right? Okay. Is it... Um, just recently saw the video that people are using the board and it didn't work. Put on blinds and suddenly... Um, San Antonio is a place where I was born in a nightmare. I used to have my head on just... got the boot for playing Ouija board on the bus. It's just, like, I know it's a game, and I think if you go into it, um, well, I don't know, I think if you, if you don't, I always want to say if you don't believe that nothing bad will happen, but that's not true. Luis? Luis? Luis. Lou? I got that part. Ease or S? Hit number one for E's, number two for S. Once a banana Ouija board. I mean, it sounds tasty. Lewis. Oh. I'm just going to call you Lewis because that's easier. Um, Lewis. It's pronounced noodles. All my noodles are gone. I ate them all. Now I have is cold broth, and that's gross. Okay, I'm gonna read your comment. Um, oh wait, you guys can all read. Them. I'm gonna read it myself. <gasps> okay, you know what's funny about your story is when we were in San Antonio, there was a a ghost tour. I forget what it was called, but it was like a, a ghost walking tour. And that was part of one of the things they talked about, I believe. And it went through the Alamo and, like, we walked all around downtown San Antonio. Um, yeah, I believe that, ma'am. Totally believe it. When we were in um, Tuscaloosa, Alabama, I believe it was Tuscaloosa, there was an old, like, battlefield that we went to. And, I mean, so many people died on that battlefield. Now you go there, it's beautiful. It's rolling hills. There's, like, some of the old buildings out. Um, but there was one part of it was a driving tour, so you basically get in your car and you drive through this old battleground, and there's places you can stop and check out. And there was, towards the end of it, there was a, a sign, and it was just a sign and it had, like, basically the areas of the battlefield and, um, if they were for the Confederacy, uh, or the, un you know, all the different, um, people, and the tally of how many people died, and I think 
they actually don't know because there was no one keeping record but i think at one point there was a sign and i believe it said like forty-two thousand people and it sounds like when you look at this area that that's not possible but so many people died and you feel that energy when you drive onto that battlefield it just feels heavy and i don't know i can feel it and it's very taxing on you when you can feel like the sadness and all of that stuff and i've honestly um i don't talk about it very much but the whole being an empath thing is uh it's very new to me and i've trying to understand what's going on uh, but it's it's very emotionally taxing to like feel what other people are feeling around you and not being able to control it no I didn't go to the basement I actually um, on another note I have an Alamo story so this was wow let me show you my spider she's crawling on the I don't know if you can see her you see her cage right there? She's right between the D and the R on the glass. Probably not going to do a whole lot of moving. That was that was her movement for the day. Um, so my Alamo story. I was the guy. Yeah, the guy keeping record probably did die. Um, I was at the Alamo. This was twenty. 13 maybe it was a while ago and uh, we had it was for a convention and I think I believe it was before the convention we all wanted to go see the Alamo I'd never been to San Antonio and I wanted to go um, this is kind of along the lines of Ozzy's getting a arrested story yeah because he, he peed on the Alamo he did that was not very nice I would I would arrest him too um, so we're there and it's literally just tourists it's like the alamo's beautiful building and it's just tourists kind of walking around taking pictures you can do a tour uh, but we didn't do the tour we just wanted to go get our, our photo in front of the alamo um, and see the basement and uh so we're walking and there's like there's a sheriff i have to find i have a picture somewhere of him like yelling at me so it was me and some friends from the convention and we're walking around out front and he comes up to me and he said uh, ma'am you you can't be here I'm like, what do you mean I can't be here? Excuse me, this is like a public space. I can be here. And he said, uh, your outfit is inappropriate. And I'm like, what do you mean inappropriate? I'm wearing like a leggings and a shirt. And uh, he said, it, you know, if you want to be here and you want to come in and you want to, you know, hang out in this area, you're going to have to go get some new pants. And I was like, excuse me? He was like, yeah, you just got to go. And I was like, from where? From the pants store down the street? He's like, you just need to go get some new pants. You're not allowed to be here. You can't take photos here. You need to go. And I was wearing leggings that had like a, a little suspender strap in the side, but there's like little cutouts on the sides and suspender leggings. You guys, I'm sure have seen them. Yet there's girls with cut off shorts with their butts hanging out. So I got kicked out of the Alamo because my pants were inappropriate. Apparently they were too sexy. Indecent exposure. Yeah. Um, at the Alamo, so Ozzy and I both got kicked out, but I didn't pee on anything, so. Oh, Chucky, I forgot you're still here. I'm gonna move him. He's just gonna be over here. Oh, this way. He's gonna hang out right there. Um, I'm trying to read your questions. Oh, that's the worst. When you just feel something's there, but there's nothing there. Got kicked out for clothes. What in tarnation? I did. And that's the accent the guy had. He was a very uh, cowboy-esque sheriff. And I, I believe, I think I took a selfie. I think I took a selfie because I wanted him, like his name. And I, I don't think the selfie was bright enough for me to see what his name was. Um, Yes, Joey Spade, you are correct. Texan. He was doing his job. He felt that my pants were inappropriate. Whatever. It's fine. You know what? I still took my pictures in front of the Alamo, and then we went back um, the next... I think I went back the next year, and I made a Pee Wee Herman latex outfit. My friend um, whipped that up for me. 
And uh, so I went in front of the Alamo and they were having some sort of ceremony. I was like, oh great, I'm gonna get kicked out again because I'm in a like skimpy latex Pee Wee Herman outfit. And I got my photo in front of the Alamo and that's all I wanted. <laughs> I got kicked by Yosemite Sam. Well, he didn't, he didn't kick me because I would have kicked him back, but I did get kicked out. Calling it a night. Later, dude, break every mold. Thanks for joining us. Latex outfit, yes, giggity. It was great. Oh, okay, who on here, I know I showed you guys earlier, but I don't think all of you guys are here. Who on here is an OBS professional? If you're an OBS professional, uh, raise your hand. I need your help. Um, I'm going to show you. Minimize this. Minimize this. Let's see if I can. Oh, no. Stop it. I have this weird, like, auto fit thing on my laptop, and it always wants to move things where I don't want them. Um, I stream and use OBS. I'm not the best. Okay, not professional, but I understand most of the basics. I'm just to be as professional. All good answers. Um, okay. Let me find the screenshot. Because I need your help. So, I showed it earlier, but I know you guys, a lot of you weren't here yet. So this is when I'm, can you, you're smarter than this camera. Come on. Focus. Focus, focus. It's not going to focus. Do it. Oh, there it is. Okay, so this is what it says when I try to open OBS. OBS is already running. Unless you meant to do this, please shut down any existing instances of OBS before trying blah blah blah. If you have OBS, like basically it's saying that it's open and uh, if it's minimized to close it out. So that's not the case. It wasn't opened. I'll be quiet. Hold on. Let me. You guys don't want to hear me over myself. Um, And so that's what it's it's telling me, and it's it's not open. I actually um, it's probably gonna take you guys a second because I'm a little behind. Um, it's basically saying you have to close it before you can open it again, but it's not opened. And actually, before I excuse me, before I streamed tonight, it was still saying the same thing. Um, and then it says, do you want to launch anyway? So I click launch anyway, and then it works. But I can't get that notification to go away, so I'm not really sure what's happening and how to fix it. I know someone had the issue. He had to reinstall OBS. I know, and that's the thing. Oh, booty fell down. Oh, she's okay. Um, that's her, my spider's name is Booty. She likes to crawl on the glass, and sometimes she falls off, but she's fine. She landed on the dirt. Um, yeah, that's the thing that I kept seeing is you have to reinstall it and I don't really want to because I have so much set up, <sighs> but I probably, I mean, I'm going to keep trying to use it where it just lets me launch it anyway and see if that, yeah, maybe there's an update. I'll see if there is. And if that's the case, cause I haven't been on stream for probably a month or longer. So maybe there's an update and I haven't done it. We'll see if that's the case. Hopefully, fingers crossed, because I really don't want to do all of this again. It was, I'm not a tech computer person, so I've had to teach myself and it's been a nightmare. Oh, the white noise boxes. Um, so, spirit box is what I call it. I'm pretty sure it's the same thing. Um, if that's what you're talking about, Fred. Yeah, you know what? Um, if you watch Ghosted, you'll notice that there was some instances where things happened that I didn't believe. I was like, this is bullshit. 
um, and you can see it in my face and I didn't want to be rude and I didn't want to call someone out and make them feel uncomfortable because that's we're not our show isn't about making fun of people our show is about exploring different avenues of the ghost hunting world and having our own opinion about it so I wasn't there to call people out and tell them they're a liar um, but I was there to have my own opinion about it so we found that there was things that would happen that you I was skeptical and I made it very clear that I was skeptical um, but then there was other things that happened that I couldn't deny so it kind of goes both ways and I feel like it's really easy to watch something on TV and just say that's bullshit that's not real that's fake it's it's edited whatever um, which I still do because some of the things that I see I'm like that is a different camera angle or that was a cut or whatever I can I there's some things that I pick apart still but the second something happens to you that's a personal experience um, it changes your whole perspective so in my opinion uh, yeah the housekeeper um, Harlan MD, you watched that episode. I think they cut out because some of it I was like looking around the room because it was just so forced. Like I would have been more appreciative of having a experience where nothing happened and someone to just say, hey, you know, we tried but nothing happened than forcing it and making it really uncomfortable and awkward for everybody. Um, but yeah, I... I've had some experiences with the spirit box and that's the thing that scans the radio frequencies and it sounds like shh, shh, shh. Uh, it's just like it sounds like white noise um, and I've had some stuff happen that I was like that's a coincidence or that doesn't sound right or that's just the radio signal but then I had some other things happen that were just unexplainable so yeah it was very cringy I agree Um, someone said we met somewhere. Where do we meet? Met a fan expo. Oh my god, 2013. That's such a long time ago. I do love Dallas and Texas, so... This year. Um, I don't think OBS has an auto launch when you start your computer option, so that's weird. If you had to reinstall OBS settings were... Um... Yeah, the only thing is, um, like setting up my scenes and I have like an IRL uh, scene then I have my countdown scene and then I have the PS4 scene so I have like it's not just one stream setup I have a couple different ones uh, for different things that I do so I mean it's not impossible but it's also not uh, something I want to spend a whole nother day doing when it's already done. So fingers crossed that there's like some sort of update that fixes it or that I could just keep running it while it's saying that it's it's glitchy and but it's it still works it's working fine so hopefully Houston comic pollute are you gonna be at NYCC um you know what I don't know that's it's so far ahead um but I find that I do end up being at New York Comic Con every year so probably um I won't know um until usually like a couple weeks before or a month before so hopefully I'm planning ahead of time and I know before then but I love New York Comic Con so I make it a point to try to get out there every year how long has our stream been going? almost two hours guys I know X-Wing um, T65 I'm hoping to get out to Europe um, soon there's some international things that I'll be doing this year which I can't announce quite yet um, but as I get more information I will definitely share that with you guys let me find my chapstick time out, I'll be right back I don't know, it's all the way over there I can't get it um, what kind of issues on OBS oh, David John Gibbons um, yes, I'm going to show you my issue. Um, hold on one second, I gotta find it again. Okay, this is the third time I've showed this. This way, this way. Focus. So what it's telling me is that OBS is already running, and that I need to close it, essentially, or minimize, if it's minimized, I need to actually close it out uh, before I open it again. But the issue is, like, I'll open the task manager and close it so it's actually not running. It's not open. And 
I even shut down the computer, restarted, and it's still showing. Actually, before I logged onto the stream, it still showed, but I just click launch anyway, and it seems to work. So I don't know how long that's going to work. Um, so if you have any suggestions on what I can do to fix that, I would love to hear it. Uh, Zombo, you know one thing that you guys have in Texas that I absolutely love? Uh, Torchy's Tacos. If anybody knows about Torchy's Tacos, let's talk about it. Because I love it. Um, yes, I want to come to Denmark. Keep asking. Bug the hell out of them. Maybe they'll bring me out. Um, Torchy's Tacos... Every time I go to Texas, we go for Texas barbecue, and then we also have Torchy's Tacos, and I get a shrimp taco, and I get a breakfast taco, and I don't remember what it's called, but, and I get chips and guacamole. That's it. A breakfast taco, a shrimp taco, chips and guacamole, and uh, they have the real cane sugar pop, or soda, as we call it here in California, um, and it's perfect. If you don't know what Torchy's Tacos is when you go to Texas, um... Are they all throughout Texas? Is it only a Texas thing? I don't know, but I only have it when I'm there. Little Red Devil is the best. I've never had that one. What's in that? Down the street. Lucky. Torchy's Tacos is the best. Um, okay, I'm going to see. Soda Pop. Just saying. I like Pop better. It sounds more awesome than soda let's mute that so we don't hear oh wow I messed up on the chat I missed all of these um, Austin has the most soda yeah, I think Torches is only a, a Texas thing. I've been to the one in Houston. I've been to the one in Dallas. I've been to the one in San Antonio. Basically, any time I go to Texas, I go to Torches Tacos. And if there's not one where we are, we go and find one. That's a strange one indeed, but it's really nice. There's obvious transfers over all your things, so give that a try and we don't know okay thanks David I'll look into that um, I'm gonna probably try to figure it out tomorrow I'm gonna try to stream again tomorrow night um, maybe we'll do some battlefront um, or some ghost hunting things I don't know we'll figure something out but I'll probably jump on tomorrow night I'll post on social so also if you are here and you're not following make sure to click the little heart and follow me uh, so you know when I go live. And I do agree, Coke or Dr. Pepper, Dr. Pepper, Dr. Pepper. I'm trying to stop drinking soda, so I've been drinking these Izzy sparkling beverage. So it's just uh, sparkling water and fruit juice. And this is, um, it's basic clementine, it's like orange soda. It's good. My sad noodle juice. I'm going to move it out of the way. <sighs> Favorite things about traveling to the States. <laughs> Wait, David, John, where are you from? Well, we also have, um, if they don't serve Dr. Pepper, they usually serve Mr. Pibb. It's the same thing, but I think one's a Coke product and one's a Pepsi product. But they taste the same. Lewis, Battlefront, yeah. They only do Coke or Pepsi in the UK. They don't have Dr. Pepper in the UK. What is wrong with the UK? That's a sad, sad place if you don't have Dr. Pepper. <laughs> Someone said RIP, bro. Um. Okay, let's try, let's play one more round of this nonsense. Watch me play this nonsense. And then, oh my god, it's midnight? 
Guys, I'm a grandma. I'm usually asleep by now. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna have one more go at this. Wait, blasphemy about no Dr. Pepper or that I'm a grandma. Also, Dr. Pepper is gross. Three kills this time. Okay. Um, we're still doing offline play because we. Yeah, you know why. Um, what one have I not done? Higgins? Have I done Higgins? I am actually a grandma. It's not a joke. Is there a grandma emoji? Hold on, I'm gonna grandma emoji this real quick. This is me. Always grandma emoji. Oh, his face, every time they show that guy's face with the sweater, I'm like, ugh. Go away, keyboard. Okay, I'm gonna move this smaller. They're out there, Jason. And get your revenge. All right, Jason, let's kill some people. Why is it so dark? Was it this dark earlier? It wasn't this dark earlier. I think I'm just in a dark place. Oh, this is a different area, so yeah. People, 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 people. Come on, run. Okay, this makes the power go out, yeah? Because it's night, I know, but it's darker than it was last time. See ya. No more power. Trying to read your comments. Oh, see, this is my problem, is I can't, this is why I can't kill anyone, because I'm reading the comments on the phone and not paying attention to what I'm doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's kill some people. Where are you? I know their job is to be sneaky and hide from me, but I don't like it. I would much prefer if they... Uh, I just like breaking the doors also. Oh! Dark Master Hazuki. The reason you probably didn't know I'm on Twitch is because social media reach right now is crap and nobody sees anything that I post and it's really frustrating so um, make sure to follow me here on Twitch get to know easier I know the one thing is I'm streaming from my laptop because I um, I travel a lot and I live in two places uh, so it makes it way easier for me to be mobile it would be way more ideal to have I have computers and stuff but to set it up where I have a second monitor, so that's definitely something that, um, thanks for the donation, X-Wing, I just saw it, um, that would definitely make it easier for me. 
run, run, run. Uh, to have a second monitor so I can see the chat and stuff. But baby steps. Someone said it early. Oh, oh, oh. I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna kill you. That's the car. In the head. Right in the head. Oh, come on. See? And then they go through. Did I get him? Jason. I mean, come on. You're like the slowest. Shit. He's gonna go out the front door. I'm ignoring your comments for a second because I'm gonna kill this guy. See, and then he's gone. <laughs> Yeah, social media reach is a travesty. It's very sad. Um, having a crazy fan base and then not being able to, like, a fan base that wants to see what you're doing and wants to be involved in what you're doing, and then they can't see anything because you have no reach. Oh, come on. Are you just gonna... How do I jump? No. Is this real right now? Um, uh, come on, sucker. Um, there's too many things happening. I don't know where he went. Oh, there he is. In his yellow sweater. Um, is he gonna go in the water? Go in the water. My favorite, my favorite, guys, is my favorite. Okay, how do I choke him under the water? One. One. Jason doesn't jump. Other guy still in the house. There is no jump. He forgot to sneak up. I know, guys. There's so much to do. There's just too many things. My multitasking skills are not clearly very good. But I've killed two. Oh, no. One. One got away. I do like the drowning. That's fun. Can we... And I like the little glimmer in the lake down there. That's pretty rad. Okay, the guy's still in the house. I don't remember what house it was, though. Oh, excuse me. See, also, it takes way too long to break the door because they're just gonna leave by the time he decides he's gonna break the door because he's very slow. Come on, you can do it. I have faith in you. You can do it. You've broken many a door in your time. There we go. Then nobody's here, cause you're slow. Oh, I hear you. Nope, you're not here. Um, yeah, I can't. If I just hold down the button, it doesn't do anything. It's a bunch of baloney. I just want to leave the house. It's super dark. Why is it so dark? It wasn't this dark earlier. Oh, they can hide under the bed? Oh, I see a flashlight. Oh, no, that was just the lake. Damn it. How do I, okay, how do I stalk? I'm like whispering like they can hear me. <laughs> Where'd he go? I see his head. 
I don't want to use the warp thing because then I always miss them. Just be, like, scary, Jason, and run faster. You can do it. No, see? Stop. Damn it. <laughs> uh, my struggle, I lost him. Somebody said R1 triangle stock. Yeah, I pressed R1 square and then I ran because I'm a ding dong. Oh, I see them. Okay. I'm gonna go. R1 triangle. He's in the house. Okay, go, go. Go faster. Yeah, I think it takes a lot of practice. Oh, you can't hear me, can you? Oh, shit. I ran out of time. I'm slow. Oh. Turn around. Where are you? Where'd he go? Ready? Or did I kill him? Oh, I killed him! Two. I'm gonna get that girl in the pink shirt now. Where'd she go? I like that emote a lot. Thank you very much for that. Where did she go? She's gonna die. I think my heart, the hardest thing for me is the, um, from not playing games for such a long time is the joysticks like the the look around and yeah I didn't even know I killed him it's sad usually I have to hit them way more but I must have got him right in the noggin oh okay wait 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 shit I got fireworked in the face she's right there too lady where are you These counselors, they're mucho sneaky. Okay. Triangle to stock. Triangle to stock. Are you coming out? Oh, where did she go? Did she go in the house? No. This is a bunch of baloney. Run. See, and then I used it too soon because then it runs out. Where are you? I only have to kill one more person in this round. Gonna find you. Oh, there. There's somebody. I see somebody. Okay. I'm gonna get him. Cause I'm gonna get him. You just wait. He's in the water. Okay, hold on. You're gonna die. Wait, how come I can't get him? Hello? Why? Is that a dead person? Why can't I get you? Sucks to be you, my friend. <sighs> Looks like that's three people dead. We're going for... How much time do I have left? Does it say? It's so tiny, I can't see.
Jason's wearing me out. He's so slow. So maybe by tomorrow, I won't suck as bad. I doubt it, but it's wishful thinking. Where are all the people at? There's how many? Eight, right? Okay, what's rage? I want to rage, but what do I need to do? I have to... Um, and then where's my map thing? Let's go here. Yeah, Jason needs to learn how to run fast. Cause this shit is getting old. I think a lot of the things too, um, like I can't do yet because I suck. <laughs> I have to be better. But thanks for telling me how to run, guys, because otherwise we'd be going like this. And I wouldn't kill anybody ever. Where's somebody at? Where's some people? Okay, so what? Vienna? I miss Vienna. I want to come back and visit soon. Okay, we're finishing this game and then I'm going to sleep. Because <laughs> it's 12.30 almost. gotta be people over there. I feel it. I feel it. That's just a fire. A person? No, that's not a person. Where is everybody? You stayed up for noodles, thanks. Good night. Thanks for staying up late with me, guys. I can't complain. It's only 12, 20 something here. You know, it would be really nice if there's some freaking counselors I could kill. that was that just happened. Come on, Jason, go faster. You're too slow. Okay, what? how do I use sets? Set the eyeball? I always forget about that one. Run. Faster. Like you mean it. They were in here, weren't they? They're in here. Where are they? You like how I whisper like they can hear me? Oh no! What? It said two minutes left. Well, three out of seven. That's not bad. I'm proud of myself. Okay. We're going to end the game. Yes, I am. And I'm gonna make this bigger. Ooh, too big. Um, okay guys, it is 12.25, past my bedtime. Um, I'm gonna go through some of the questions that I might have missed on here. 
<laughs> Thanks for you guys for joining me. People all the way from Vienna and the UK, all over the place. It's awesome. I'm glad you guys came to hang out. Uh, good night to everyone that is going to bed. Um, if you are not subscribed, please make sure to, well, not, you can't sub, sub yet because I'm not verified, but, um, you can follow so you'll get notifications on when I go live. I'm going to try to stream again tomorrow night, uh, maybe some more Friday the 13th game. Oh crap, I didn't change it in the, whatever. Um, either some more of that or maybe some Battlefront, so I'll post on social. Um, also, huge favor from you guys that are here. If you're not following me yet on YouTube, I'm just at vamp, or I'm youtube.com slash vamp. Uh, follow me and check out my latest videos. They changed all the policies over there on YouTube, so it's really frustrating. Um, but you guys would be doing me a solid if you go over there and uh, subscribe and also watch some of my latest videos. I have a bunch of my other Twitch streams on there. I'm probably going to load this up too, so if you missed it, you can watch it. Um... Let's see, thanks for watching and putting up with my um, terrible gameplay. Although, we went from killing one person to two people to three people in each round. So I do have to say improvement, right? A little improvement. So thanks for watching, um, I appreciate you guys. Stay tuned, make sure that you're following, and then I will update you manana about what time I'm going to be going live. Probably tomorrow night again in the evening. Um, I might start a little bit earlier, but I'll let you guys know. Thank you guys for hanging out. I'm going to start doing this more, so I'll see you guys on here more. Tomorrow we'll play some games, we'll hang out, uh, maybe eat some noodles, but we'll see. Alright guys, love you, thanks for watching, see you soon!